if I told you that every step you take today was set in motion by the very first human, created from clay, given life by a single breath, and tasked with a mission that still echoes in every soul today. In the very beginning, before the mountains stood tall and the oceans roared, there was a moment of silence. In that silence, the Creator fashioned the first human, Adam, peace be upon him. From the earth itself, a blend of dust and divine will. His creation wasn't just a physical act, but a powerful declaration. Humanity had begun. As Adam opened his eyes for the first time, he saw the beauty of paradise surrounding him, a place of endless peace and eternal light. But his true journey began when he received a unique gift, knowledge. Adam, unlike any other creation, was taught the names of all things, a sign of his role as the first teacher, the first father, and the first to carry the trust of free will. But paradise had its tests, a test of obedience, a test of choice, when Adam and his companion, Hawa, Eve, were tempted to eat from the forbidden tree. They faltered. In that moment, humanity's journey truly began, not in paradise, but on earth, where choices have consequences and life's true purpose unfold. Here's where the story takes a turn. Adam didn't dwell in despair. Instead, he turned to his creator, seeking forgiveness. And with that, the first lesson for all of humanity was taught. No matter how far we stray, the door to repentance is always open. This is the story of the first human, Adam, whose journey from paradise to earth was not just about a fall, but about the rise of humanity itself. From the first step he took, he laid the path that every single one of us walks today. A path of choices, mistakes, forgiveness, and ultimately, the pursuit of purpose. And so, the question isn't whether we will make mistakes, we all do, but rather, will we find the courage, like Adam, to seek forgiveness and continue the journey?